Hello, I am Dr. Prakash Mahadevappa. I am a general surgeon, a senior consultant in the Department of General Surgery, Columbia Asia Hospital, Whitefield. Thyroid gland is a very essential endocrine gland which produces the hormone called thyroxin which is essential for complete body metabolism this thyroid gland is situated in the front of the neck just below the adam's apple there are two glands one is the right and the left lobe connected towards in the center enlargement of this thyroid gland is called as goiter the enlargement may be due to many causes the most common one is iodine deficiency this happens iodine deficiency can give rise to complete nodular and massive enlargements of the thyroid this is frequently seen in some of these uh, hilly areas where iodine is very deficient at the same having said this iodine in excess also can cause a goiter or the enlargement of the thyroid as we see in and the western societies the thyroid it can be uniformly enlarged or it can be unequally enlarged when it is unequally enlarged and there is a dominant nodule we are uh, to be worried about the possibilities of a cancer in these glands so these glands when there is an unequal or a nodule which is hard in consistency these needs further evaluation by need of a fine needle aspiration cytology or to study the uh, cell architecture to find out whether there is any cancerous tissues in this if that is so it probably will require surgical or uh, surgical therapy or even radio iodine therapy depending upon what type of cancer it is and this thyroid gland uh, can also get enlarged due to other inflammations other reasons like inflammation or infection even a bacterial infection can give rise to thyroid enlargement and subacute thyroiditis uh, is a sort of an autoimmune thyroiditis that is something like uh, a rheumatoid arthritis or a joint disease the thyroid uh, gets inflamed and give rise to uh, uh, enlarged thyroid with which is very tender to palpate and this sort of inflammations will ultimately destroy that gland and the patient will be experiencing uh, deficiency of the, high, uh, the thyroxin hormones which the thyroid has to produce and these patients will need thyroxin supplement at a later date